A lot of you guys don't know, but for the next six months, I'm going out the country once a month, somewhere random. Oh, this is the first trip to Tokyo, Japan. I was gonna go alone, but you know, somebody wants to tag along, so I got my hey, brother with me. Heckin', man. man, we're going first time. I'm excited, bro. Tokyo, Japan, man, somewhere we've always wanted to go. And so, look forward to the adventures. We're gonna talk about the best food, the safest ways to get around, the most fun things to do out there in Tokyo. You know, we're obviously gonna take pictures. Oh yeah. And uh, man, it's, it's gonna be a blessed time, man. Man, of course Diego got held up at the airport, bro, with TSA. Man, of course it would be you to get held up. Hey, suspicious. It looks like you got some walk in your bag. What is that? What is walk? I took the walk to Poland. <laughs> All right, so what are you most excited for for Tokyo? Man, aside from the food, just the everyday adventure of like the... The, spon the spontaneous part of it, we don't even know what we're gonna do, but we know we're gonna have a blast. Oh yeah, hey, we, we see T Grizzly over there. Uh, if you guys don't know T Grizzly, well, you just don't know. Him. All right, good leg room. Number one tip when you're traveling, man, you always gotta get something for the flight. You know what I mean? Always a little dessert. These international flights have pre-boarding meals. You can order one while you book your flight. So I'm gonna have a meal pretty soon. Zip Air is the airline. Pretty good leg room. I'm 6'3", so like, this is pretty, pretty good. It's a little weird, all these COVID restrictions stuff. You gotta walk through, gotta sign paperwork and all that. Just a heads up, make sure you're either vaccinated fully, and that's with three, um, three shots. So, you know, the first two doses plus one booster or 72 hours before departure from whatever, wherever you're departing from. So make sure you get that COVID test. If you guys come out here and you don't want to pay like ten dollars a day like me for phone service and all that stuff you can always purchase a little wi-fi box so that you can bring around have wi-fi everywhere you want to go so it's pretty convenient this is so good but what's crazy is i don't know what i'm drinking because it's all in japanese Hey, what's up, bro? What's up, bro? Cleanest train ever. Oh, to rent a bike, bro? Are you serious? So, we were about to go get some food, but man, this sky tower behind me, fire. We had to shoot that. Diego got the camera set up. So, man, stay tuned for these photos, man. Overwhelming how beautiful and like how much stuff they got out here, bro. It's crazy. Crazy. Like, this is I was trying to cheat for the first time, man. Good, bro. Yeah, cheers. That's, the, that's a bad start. Mm. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow. It's like steak. A little more chewy. If you ever come here Dude, that's so good. to Japan, try cheese. Try chicken. Yeah, right? <laughs> <laughs> oh, it tastes like chicken. 
It's like a bunch of fat. The order in here is a process. Like, make sure you have the, your transfer app so you can talk back to somebody. Literally pointed to the menu was like chicken. And we're like beef. <laughs> yeah, I'm excited for this though. Heck yeah. I only knew how to order this just because I've had it before based on the picture. You know what I mean? I just posted that. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, brother. Hold on, brother, man. <coughs> Yo. Oh no, that is spicy. It's not spicy in the mouth. It's just for the throat, like. No, it is weird. You feel me? And my mouth isn't hot. It's You're just, right. <coughs> it just stuck. So our total, our total bill comes out to thirteen hundred Japanese, Japanese yen. That's only eight dollars, eight dollars and eighty cents. Come on, man. Let's see what they got to eat here, man. Okay, so like I've heard you can eat at 7-Eleven here like on a normal basis like breakfast lunch dinner But now I know exactly what they're talking about like this is crazy Can we drink alcohol on the street here? Yeah, okay. Oh, oh. Fried chicken skewer and a curry pork bun $3. I'm about to get full off this. Sorry. That don't look bad. It's not bad, but the, there's something about the chicken out here that makes it taste like very, very fatty. Yeah. That is so good. Oh, yeah. My surprise. Wow. Yeah, that's actually. That's crazy. It is weird, too, because, like, the bun, it tastes like kind of like a pastry, but then the inside is like. Curry and just like yeah, that's good. Mmm. Thank you. Mango. That's fire. That is really good. You could drink alcohol on the street here, like yeah. regular. So we Google translated it with the cashier. She goes, "I speak English." Mm -hmm. But the other two that we were trying to speak yeah. to didn't. So. <laughs> but yeah, that's cool that you could like literally just walk out here. And they said it's normal out here. It's really normal to just walk around with alcohol here. One of the biggest things I've always tried to figure out is does McDonald's taste the same when you're not in America? You know what I mean? Like McDonald's to me is trash in America. But we're gonna see how it is in Tokyo. All right, man, let's really see if this McDonald's out here is better than you know, America, man. I heard some things. I heard it's like a five-star type of burger. Same. What are we talking about, man? He's in car for the light. Okay, okay, okay. Nice, nice, nice. So, me and Diego, I'm 6'3. Diego's like 5'8. Let's just go with 5'9. 5'9? <laughs> so, if you're bringing a big suitcase, I don't know if you want to, you know, you might want to look at those hotel sizes because all the hostels, all the hotel rooms out here are pretty small, the Japanese style. So just make sure you get a big enough hotel room. It's been a it's been a nice little night. You know, we, we landed around 5 p.m. Um, and we only had a little bit of time to really go out and explore. But tomorrow, we got things planned, man. So you guys stay tuned. Yo, you out of the shower, bro? Yeah. Man, that shower is so refreshing, bro. Yeah. <laughs> what? Like, man. <laughs> Anyways, man, tomorrow stay tuned. We got a fun day ahead. Um, we're gonna show you what it's really like to have fun in Tokyo.